U.S. Border Patrol agents caught doing special favor for Trump, liberals are furious. Illegal immigration activists are outraged after discovering that the U.S. Border Patrol found a special gift that they left behind and destroyed it. The video now circulating online has liberals fuming and American patriots cheering. According to Daily Mail, a report has been released by illegal immigration activist groups who pose as humanitarian organizations accusing the U.S. Border Patrol of causing the deaths of hundreds of illegal immigrants. The activist groups, named No More Deaths and La Coalition de Derricos Humanos, are furious after U.S. Border Patrol agents destroyed supplies of food and water that they left behind for illegal immigrants trying to get into the United States. The report was released on Wednesday. January 17, 2018, and provides details on how the two groups have distributed more than 31,000 gallons of water in the desert for illegal immigrants who have traveled through Arizona between 2012 and 2015. These two groups should be rounded up and prosecuted for aiding and abetting criminals who are entering our country illegally. Their report provides all the evidence needed to bring charges against them. According to Public News Service, the two groups claim that their volunteers have found stashes of food and water destroyed about 415 times. They also claim these discoveries happen about two times a week on average. If they are leaving food and water for illegal immigrants, they are responsible for encouraging them to commit a crime. Furthermore, they are the ones responsible for causing deaths in the Arizona desert, not our U.S. Border Patrol agents. In a statement released by the two groups they claim statistical analysis, video evidence, and personal experiences provide evidence of the supplies being destroyed. They claim that in the majority of the incidents, U.S. Border Patrol agents are to blame. In my opinion, U.S. Border Patrol should be thanked and given a pay raise for this work. Our agents face life and death situations on a daily basis while they search for illegal immigrants and save many lives in the process. The report also claims that U.S. Border Patrol agents are guilty of human rights violations. That sounds like typical liberal hype and the reality here is that our Border Patrol agents have to deal with a multitude of problems being caused by these humanitarian groups. These groups aren't fooling anyone, they are simply helping illegal immigrants break our laws and nothing more. The practice of destruction of and interference with aid is not the deviant behavior of a few rogue Border Patrol agents. It is a systemic feature of enforcement practices in the borderlands, the report adds. The activists also claim that as a result of ramped up security in the past few years, illegal immigrants have been forced to take more dangerous routes through the tall mountains where temperatures can typically reach over 100 degrees in the summer. The groups advocate that illegal immigrants consume between 1.3 to 3.1 gallons of water per day while making the arduous trip across the border. The journey they say, can take anywhere between three days to nearly a month depending on the rate of travel and route. The following is a video of the U.S. Border Patrol disposing of supplies left behind by the criminal activist groups. I think our men and women in uniform on the border are doing an outstanding job and should continue to track the movements of these groups so that the supplies they leave behind can be properly disposed of. The activists close their report by making the following demand of the United States government, We demand that U.S. Customs and Border Protection permanently dismantle the U.S. Border Patrol and establishes a reparations program for the families of all persons disappeared and deceased as a result of the U.S. Border Policy of Prevention through Deterrence. Of course, the demands in their report are ludicrous. President Donald Trump will not disband the U.S. Border Patrol and reparations will not be paid to the families of illegals who have died trying to break our laws. In fact, Trump is expected to add nearly 5,000 more Border Patrol agents to the ranks in the next couple of years in addition to building a border wall. I believe it's time for these activists' group to come out of their liberal echo chambers and actually pay attention to what is going on our country. Their extremist views aren't welcome among American patriots and no longer being nurtured by our government now that Barack Obama and his buffoonery are behind us. us.